Alright guys, I don't know what's going on. I'm in the middle of nowhere. It's dark. It's um, What is it 3 17 a.m. in the morning? Out in the middle of nowhere in Alaska Okay, I uh, left my home to be um, Like in the nature and stuff And everything was fine for a while then, shortly after, I decided that, you know, I need to go to bed. I was just in my, in my tent, you know, sleep, sleeping, or try, you know, actually I was reading the book. Guess what happens? We have a fire truck show up first. And then like five different police cars next <laughs> I cannot believe this I can't still believe this and then there's a helicopter there's a fucking helicopter at 3 fucking a.m. in the morning flying over my head right now with a flashlight on um, I'm sure you can hear the helicopter He's circling around. So my sleep has been interrupted for the night. I'm just too excited. And I heard him coming in uh, for a while. And at first I was like, sirens. How am I hearing sirens out here? You know? And I was like, and then like the, I think they were not really like blaring sirens. They were just going like, whoop, 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 whoop. Whoop, whoop, coming down the road right and the birds starting kind of like replying to them the birds on the like the loons they're st they starting making the, those loon sounds right to kind of responding to the to to the uh, alarms it's kind of chilly out here so I'm kind of shaking um and I was like okay so I think that must be the birds or the nature sounds or whatever but then as the sirens got closer, I'm like, no, that's police sirens at 3 fucking a.m. in the morning. I came here to connect with nature. I came here to seek solitude. I came here for the quiet because the road I live on is super loud. Like super loud. 
there's some human howling going on right now. Like someone is howling, like they're distraught. Some. I don't know if you can hear it, but I think someone like took too many drugs or some shit. There's something extremely dramatic going on. People are just trying to have some peace out here. They're just trying to have some good time, you know? Is everyone okay? They just looked at me and didn't say anything. There's another one seems to be leaving now. Yeah, flash your brights at me, why don't you? Go ahead and flash your lights at me. Leave. People want to sleep, people want to connect with fucking nature. <clears throat> but they can't. That's a state trooper. That's official state trooper car. Right there. It seems to be leaving now. They seem to be all leaving now. Good lord. Another state trooper. There's a couple more cars just sitting there now. Their houses flashing. That's it. I just really wonder what this is all about. There's a couple more pickup trucks just sitting there. Um, police seem to have left. There's a couple more. If you can see, like, really out in the distance there, right there. Some tail lights a little bit farther down the trail. I don't know what happened. There was some kind of like human howling going on. Like someone was in a, little, a lot, a lot of distress or some something like that. Like a woman was howling. <clears throat> I don't know what happened. I don't know if it was like drug related or what. But just bizarre, bizarre experience out in the middle of nowhere in Alaska, out in the nature, where you would think everything is supposed to be nice and quiet. 3 a.m. in the morning. So those two police that uh, left, that I just recorded, you can't really see it right now, but they're sitting on the other side of the lake. They're not going back to their whatever headquarters if you can see their lights are still flashing that's the police officer sitting right there on the other side of the lake they just drove down a little bit down the road and stopped there what is going on why oh yeah it's the Volvo it's the Volvo that came here left and came back and brought all these cups with them and they got no taillights too I don't know what's happening I think they're there to pay their fee now like their parking fee or camping fee see how it's stopped right there that's the that's the fee station right there I'm not sleeping no more I want to know what's going on
I don't know, guys. This has been my experience. <laughs> Actually, for the first time on the campground, I see anything like this happen. And I've lived up here for 11 years. I think that's the Volvo coming back again. Oh no. Yeah, oh yeah. No, yeah, yeah, that's the Volvo. That's the Volvo again. They're coming back. They went to the fee, fee station again. Thank God for the next extra pack of smokes that I grabbed at the store before coming here. No kidding. And I just came back um, to this little trail right here. You can't see it. It's too dark. But those cops are still there. I can still see them sitting there with their flashing lights. You can, yeah, you can see them right now. They're still sitting there. Hey, you guys know what happened? Uh, yeah, someone had an accident. Oh, that's yeah. all? Yeah. Like a medical emergency yeah. or something? Okay, everyone is okay? Yeah. All right, well, good to know. Thank all right, you. thanks. You heard it. Someone had an accident. An accident. Well, guess what? Someone's coming back. And it looks like a pickup truck. Yeah, it looks like a fire department pickup truck. Hmm. No flashing lights though, or sirens, or anything like that. Interesting. Those two other uh, pickup trucks that they came earlier, they're still there. So, a couple more people are coming. And it looks like it's a trooper with his light bar on. That's his light bar, super bright. I guess I'm uh, not getting any sleep tonight. Look at those bright ass lights. That's his light bar right there. Yeah, I have all the reasons to record you right now. You don't need to fucking stop by. And there's another vehicle with flashing lights right there. See it? That came in, turned around, and went back. I don't know. Now it looks like one of the pickup trucks is backing, backing up or whatever. I don't know. Okay, guys. So, the helicopter part that I failed or my phone failed to record I'm hearing it right now it look it sounds like it actually was sitting on the other side of the lake right next to the cops where I showed you and now it took off like it it uh, started up and took off and it sounds like it's flying away but we shall see I don't know you hear it Hold on. One of the pickup trucks had left, looks like. They're leaving. 
as the helicopter is making a bunch of noise now. <clears throat> As you can see, 4 a.m. in the morning, it's starting to get light. You can see the sky now. That's the helicopter right there. You see it? That's it right there. That's the one that was flying around with a flashlight. It looks like they're taking off. They left. So now I'm thinking it could have been like a life med uh, helicopter or some shit. Maybe because they didn't have ambulances available and they flew a helicopter here. That could be a possibility. I mean, that happens all the time, so I don't know. And it looks like the pickup truck that was sitting there the whole time with their hazards on they're turning around right now and looks like they're gonna leave <clears throat> so that's the last pickup truck to uh, leave the area that's the last one And then, oh, the state trooper or the, whatever. No, it looks like a fire department. This is fire department on the side. So the second vehicle left, and then there's another one coming. One more vehicle leaving. I think that's another pickup truck that was there. Oh, never mind. That's the fire department pickup truck that just came. Let's hope I can go back to sleep now, huh? That'll be great. Hey guys, I just wanted to make a separate video uh, with the daylight. So kind of give you a perspective of what was going on last night. So this is, this is my campsite. This is where I'm at. This is that little trail I was talking to you telling you about I see how it goes up there and there is no access to the lake but I think this is like a, an additional little site where you can set up your tent if you have a ground tent and here is the lake this is where I was standing when I was recording the cops last night they were there somewhere like right there somewhere um, that is also where the helicopter took off from and it flew up there so let me show you the other side so Imagine 3 a.m. me sleeping up there, not sleeping, trying to, and all this going down. Um, so, yeah. This is where I came out to talk to that Volvo driver to ask what was going on. So I stopped right here and asked her what happened. She said there was an accident, and that is the fee station right there. You can't see down the trees, but I'm going to walk over there and just uh, show you right there. This is where it stopped like two times to pay the fee. And this is where the Volvo was going, and that's like a, um, a circular driveway, so it goes around and comes back out. So the Volvo did it twice. It went again to the fee station, came around, came back. So when I did that the second time, I came out and asked them what happened. And the spot where everything was going on, <clears throat> where the um, 
where the cops went was literally right where those people are walking, right there. It was right there on that curve. There's a couple of people walking. That's where about it happened. So, like, two or three um, camping spots away from me. Lucky me, huh? Just wanted to chill by the lake. So, yeah. Hope that makes things a little bit more clear.